Hi guys, check out MuleFactory.com for the cheapest around of Foot21 coins. They're brand new out now, obviously the prices will change every day due to the fact that obviously the FIFA has just came out, so don't take these prices for gospel, but they do the safest comfort trade around guys, all legit and will be fast orders. Obviously bear with them at the start because there will be a lot of orders, but use the checkout code down below of Owen FIFA to get yourself a discount. Thank you. Hey guys, what's going on today? Welcome to a brand new video. Today is going to be a video showing you how to get the best start on FIFA Ultimate Team. So a lot of you might have just got the game new in the last day or so, so I'm going to be showing you a few little tips to get started here, and we'll see how we do with that. So we're going to be starting off here first. You want to go to the objective section, and always try and complete these little objectives, guys, when you're first on the game. Obviously the season process isn't really an issue. Like, I'll just accept this while I talk, and um, we'll take the squirrel for something that I won't use. It's just another pointless thing for the club, but um, <clears throat> there's a lot of these little things in these objectives that you can do like if you're new to the game you don't want to trade say straight away if you're not really a trader like fair enough um i think it's the best thing to do though but you can get a lot of coins and some of these things like on the uh, milestone section so if you go down here this is the best one um the assist one here if you get um like all these different assists and stuff you get loads of packs and stuff here like 100 assists and stuff matches you get a rare player pack um, like a hundred matches obviously, but then like a hundred midfield passes with players with 75 plus. I don't know, there's all sorts of stuff there. Then the finishing ones, there's like 250 goals with players, 85 plus. Loads of different things in here, and there's also this 500 goals with a squad rating of 85. So you can go get a 100k pack. Same in here, look at the bottom. This is the one you want to get. You can go into squad battles, give an 85 rating on beginner, and just absolutely bash out 12 14 games. You get two like 100k packs there. Something to do, obviously, if you want to go and do that. Um, and then this is like win friendlies, I don't know if you want to do that. But obviously there are little stuff to build towards, like finesse shots here. You get a 50k up scoring 100 finesse goals. And same, like you get these other different things here. 500 goals of a squad rating, like I just said. Um, yeah, there's some few little different things in there that you can grab. And then obviously there's stuff in here, like for champion stuff that you can get in the future um, at some point. Same with Div Rival, you can go and win yourself. A Jumbo Red Player like winning 50 rival matches. And just go through the stuff that you can, like it's pretty simple. And then like you do want to come and do the SBCs, so you want to come out here like this. This might be to Tenali, sorry if it does. Yeah, it does. You want to go in these like hybrid leagues, hybrid nations. And this is the best SBC I complete. It costs about 4k and you get a rare mixed player pack. I got an inform from this pack, so you want to complete all of these. I just really can't be bothered at the moment. Um, it's a lot of effort to go through, especially when I trade, there's no real point to it. Same as Tenali, don't complete it, it's pretty pointless. But there's loads of different stuff. Obviously, you can also, if you really want to do the foundation, like let's keep going, SBCs, League and Nation basics you get a few little packs and whatever but you can actually just grind the game if you don't want to trade at the start like i there's pretty simple ways to trade like i picked this guy up here for 2.2k and he sold for 3.9 that's like doubling my coins straight away um but yeah there's loads of different things that you can do that like these rush because they they literally you can win them on bid sometimes for like 2k and they sell for 5k so loads of little things that you can do to get started and a, a method that i would say like a perfect getting started method is this so you want to go onto the transfer market and you want to put in that's the first one you know, is england silver rare and then go to like 500 around that yeah like, so it's not up at 500 600 is where they are all at so you want to sit at like f maybe five and just try and snipe because some of them will be worth more than 600 that's what you've got to think so if you sit here like this there might be some competition on it i don't know too much as to what's going on in here but look like lafondre there we go let's see what this guy is going for now adam lafondre here is going for let's say to be safe, 650. I mean, you'll get 650 for 600. It's just went for 600 because one at 650 there. It's 150 coin profit. That's the same as like playing half a game, and it took you how long? What, like literally a few seconds? Same here, Danny Bath. I mean, probably goes for 600, but let's just check. I mean, you can see he's a 600 player, but it'll be some of these that do go for 1k, 1.5k, stuff like that. So it's always worth just sitting here and refreshing it because even if you get the ones like, I mean, Cooper, look, I mean, I missed that one there. But it's so easy. Like, people that sit, I mean, I was watching a stream yesterday, I won't name names, but literally, he, he spent seven hours on the game and made 6k, and he's like a big trader. Like, it's so, I could literally do this for 10 minutes and have like the same amount of coins. But people try and do silly stuff at the start, but I was like, 
And so many simple methods like there look we've literally like sold that on straight away 600 and this is the fund will sell on probably in the next like 10 15 minutes um so if you have like a couple of k just go out there and do this and then just keep doing it like you'll see more will come up like it's pretty easy 450 for livermore that would have been a good one like look see what i mean imagine if you'd have got that it's literally 2k you probably get 1.8 from quickly 1.6 maybe um but yeah it's just so easy to do like the you might miss the occasional ones, but if you're fast and good at sniping, um, your body coins are fast. You could even play a game and go and do this for five minutes, play another game if you wanted to. Like it's pretty like simple stuff. Like Matt Smith probably goes for six hundred, but he, again, like we'll just check him. Um, I'm gonna maybe go for six fifty here. This could be a no, six hundred, but again, it's what like five percent tax, so it's what ten ten percent sixty thirty coins. It's seventy coins a card guaranteed, and that's literally with the worst players so that's 210 coins i've made in literally like three minutes maybe two minutes and like that's a game takes 15 minutes and you get 500 coins so on that sort of average you're making ourselves like three times what you would in a game so i mean it depends if you have fun playing the game i'd rather put pins in my eyes and play the game so it's just one of them really if you want to play it then obviously i don't blame you but literally there's no real like reason why i would want to play it um it just makes me angry and we'll do this for like another two seconds here try and get another one it's quite an in-depth video this one there we go oh shit i missed him but it's probably still going to be there yeah he was there i was just slow but look you can see here this guy again is like a 700 800 coin player um but uh yeah guys thanks for watching if you want to see a video where i go from like zero coins and build my way up to like 100k or something i will do it um but yeah guys thanks for watching please drop a like if you're new and i will see you all next time